following an impressive two games against American League East foe, Baltimore Orioles, New York Yankees right fielder, Aaron Judge is looking to make up for some lost time, before he sustained a chip fracture in his right wrist last season, Judge was on pace to match some of his 2017 season totals, batting .2 a 3 with 26 home runs and 61 RBIs. When the 26-year-old finally came back, his hitting definitely wasn't the same. He finished the season with only 112 games under his belt with his final batting average lowering to .278, however, there was a lot of promise in Judge last season and it's starting to show that he's been putting the work in at the plate. Assuming all goes well in the health department, the improvements in Judge's game show that he's primed for an even bigger year than the one he had in 2017 where he finished second in the AL. MVP vote. Want your voice heard? Join the Empire Rights Back team. Write for us, the individual AL. Talent is extremely competitive, and it may be difficult for Judge to stand toe-to-toe -to -toe against other big names such as Mike Trout, Mookie Betts, and Alex Bregman. That being said, his improved contact hitting, discipline in the box and overall gains as an outfielder, could easily make him a serious contender for the award, which is something that could impact not only him, but the Yankees organization forever. Being donned a captain of any team is a great honor, but being the captain for the most successful team in sports history is almost a one-way ticket to the Hall of Fame. Aaron is not only a great player when healthy, but he's arguably now the biggest name in New York sports since the last captain of the Yankees, Derek Jeter. There's only ever been 15 captains to grace the Bronx and rep the legendary pinstripes, and there's a reason for that. It's not about being the best player in the league, it's about being the face of a franchise and somebody that fans are proud to call their own. When you look at the criteria to be a great captain for the New York Yankees, Judge fits the bill. At only 26, the leader of this Yankees squad is already established as one of the faces of baseball. He's a personable, down-to-earth player that fans have fallen in love with since his rise to baseball prominence and that's not even discussing what he does off the field. When he's not on the diamond, Judge is an active member of New York. Earlier this year, he announced his All Rise Foundation, which is designed to support youth in the city community and has already had a foundation event, hosting a pro camp for little leaguers aspiring to make it big. He's also made an appearance on Jimmy Fallon's The Tonight Show, and one could say he's definitely a man of the New York people. Is Aaron Judge the best player in baseball? No, but neither was Jeter. Was the imprint that Jeter left on the game not only as a player, but as a great individual that gave him such a high status in the baseball world. He never received an MVP, nor was he biggest star in the sport, that's why Judge has an opportunity to make Yankee history. Given the tools that this 6'7", 280-pound man possesses, he has the clubhouse knowledge, likability and heart to captivate the baseball world for 162 games while the Bronx Bombers are on their quest for number 28. Next, three storylines to follow for the Yanks early in the season if Judge can lead this Yankees team back to the baseball throne and secure a very attainable MVP in the process, I don't see why Hal Steinbrenner wouldn't honor him for his achievements on and off the diamond, making him the 16th captain in the history of the New York Yankees.